Now in this problem, we have to find value of x. So we have been given an equation that is 4 raised to the power x plus 10 raised to the power x is equals to 25 raised to the power x. So we have to find value of x. So this x, this x and this x. So what we will do, we will divide by right hand side. So on the right hand side, we have 25 raised to the power x. So what we will do, we will divide throughout by 25 raised to the power x. So we will have 10 raised to the power x divided by 25 raised to the power x. And this is 25 raised to the power x divided by 25 raised to the power x. Now if you remember, we have a rule that is a raised to the power m divided by b raised to the power m. This is nothing but a by b raised to the power m. So using this rule we can write 4 by 25 raised to the power x plus 10 by 25 raised to the power x and this side we have 1. Now we can further simplify this 10 by 25 we can write so this is 4 by 25 raised to the power x plus this will become 2 by 5 raised to the power x is equals to 1. And we can also write 4 by 25 this is nothing but 2 by 5 whole square and we have a power of overall that is x. 2 by 5 raised to the power x is equals to 1. Now if you remember we have another formula that is a by b and then you have raised to the power m and then whole power you have n then we can write a by b raised to the power m times n. So if I use this rule I can write this term 2 by 5 raised to the power 2x plus 2 by 5 raised to the power x is equals to 1. Now we can also write this term a by b mn this is nothing but a by b raised to the power n and then whole power m so we can write like this. So if I use this what we can do is we can write 2 by 5 raised to the power x and overall power 2 and this will be 2 by 5 raised to the power x is equals to 1. Now we have all the ingredients. So what we can do is now we can put 2 by 5 is equals to 2 by 5 raised to the power x. We can put some variable. Let us call this variable as by. So a new variable we are introducing. So now this equation becomes, this becomes by a square plus by is equals to 1. Or if I take this one this side, so this will become by a square plus by minus 1 is equals to 0. So this is a quadratic equation. So if you remember, if you have a quadratic equation, ax square plus bx plus c is equals to 0 then root of this equation is given by minus b plus minus b square minus 4ac divided by 2a. So now I can find root of this equation by a square plus by minus 1 is equals to 0. So in this case root will be, so root of this equation minus b that is minus 1 because here I have 1 plus minus minus b plus minus b a square so 1 a square minus 4 ac so 4 times 1 times minus 1 because c is minus 1 divided by 2a a is basically in this case 1 so what we will have so we will have root that is minus 1 plus minus this will be minus minus plus so this will be root 5 divided by 2 now 
one root is negative another root is positive so one root is minus one plus root five divided by two another root is minus one minus root five divided by two now negative root is not possible because this term is by a square so by a square cannot be negative so this root is not accepted so this root is not possible so we will consider this as the only root Uh, basically this is not by a square this is so this is root for by so the by value so by is basically 2 by 5 raised to the power x so this term cannot be negative so it is not possible that this term will be negative term this can be zero but it cannot be negative so this is not a negative term so if this is not negative that's why this root is not accepted so now we know that y is equals to 2 by 5 raised to the power x and this root is root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. So now how will you solve this? So we can do, we can take log both sides. So let us take log both sides. So I can take log this side of this whole term and then log this side also of whole term. Now, if you remember the rule of log, so we can write this as a x times log of 2 by 5. And this will be log of root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. So from here, I can write value of x. So x will be simply, x is simply log of root 5 minus 1 divided by 2 and this divided by log 2 by 5. So this is the answer for x. So I hope you like this video and if you like please share and subscribe to my channel and I will see you with more problems in the next video. Thank you.